What's good YouTube? It's your boy Keontae back with another video. This video is going to be a story time, two story time. I was going to make separate videos like one story, I mean one video about this story, one video about this story. But I fight this doing too much so I could just do both at one. I do got hair so don't think I'm bald. People ask me did I cut my hair. No I did not cut my hair. I would never cut my hair bro. It's just in the ponytail right now. I'm going to be giving y'all two story times if y'all already going to hit this. What? I don't know. I haven't did a video in so long. So, all right. But anyways, if you go ahead and get to the video, make sure y'all like, subscribe, all that, bro. So me and the gang, the slime squad, all that. Every day it was we linking up with each other. We finna do this today. We finna do like when I tell y'all we were some great savages, some great savages. So we did whatever we wanted to do. We was wild back then, bro. This when you really couldn't tell us nothing. I mean, you still can't. Well, me, you can't. But this was the days when we really ain't listening. We was hard hit. If you from Michigan, then you know what family fair is. But I think they got a family fair like other places too. But anyways, bro. So we went there, right? And we would always go there though, like on some like if it's if it's not every day, then we was going like every other day. We went like we ain't always buy stuff, so that could have been why the workers didn't like us. But still, like we weren't really. I mean, okay, no. <laughs> It was just one day though, this lady, she would always watch us. Like, it, I, I felt like she was racist. It was one day we went there, right? And bro, we literally wasn't even in like in the store for like 10 minutes, not even five minutes. So we walk in, right? We go down the aisle to have like, we were, we went down the aisle with the comments, but we wasn't getting no kind Somehow we ended up splitting up. This is when like the iPhone 5C was out. I had the green iPhone 5C. My cousin, he had the 5S and we thought we was the rawest niggas ever. So the worker, this one worker lady that I'm telling y'all about, she come up to me. I was putting my green phone. Now, I don't know how she mistake bright ass green phone. Cause you know, they had yellow, they had green, they had pink, they had blue, they had white. I don't, I'm not understanding how she mistaked a green, a bright ass. I don't know how she mistaked an iPhone this color for something. I'm sliding my phone in my pocket. So I guess she thought I was taking something. So she walked up, she's like, you want to take whatever you just put in your pocket out? You know, me being a savage that I am, just in case y'all forget, savage had it right there. I went off, bro. Y'all know that little freeze y'all be doing when somebody had y'all fucked up. I said, what you mean? And I put my phone out. And when I tell y'all the look on her face, she was so salty, bro. I said, I don't gotta take shit from your store. This is a whole phone. I don't gotta steal shit from here, bro. I'm like, I come here and I buy all my shit faithfully. I don't gotta steal shit, fuck. You feel me? Like, I really went off on her, bro. Then I walked off, like, she really felt salty. Like, you really just had to do the walk of shame. Not only did you just accuse somebody for stealing that wasn't, but you just got your ass treated. So I walk off, I'm trying to find a game and tell them what happened. I had told my mom what happened, like this really this lady really tried to play me, bro. Mama did the same thing I did. She treated her ass, bro. So not only did you get treated by me, but you got treated by my OG too. I wanted to ask her like on a scale from one to mad, how mad are you? <laughs> hey, but look, then I got another story time for y'all. Boom, check it out. E and the squad, gang gang, we went to this store called Rite Aid. If you're from Michigan, then you know what Rite Aid, Rite Aid is too. For some reason, Rite Aid was the store that we always fucked up. It was one day we had went to Rite Aids. I don't know why we came up with this idea to do this. I I, I really don't know why we did it. And I'll tell y'all, we talked, well, we didn't mess up the whole story. I didn't think it was just like one or two hours. But when I tell y'all, we told him hours up, bro. I don't know, I guess we was just like daring each other. That's what it was. We was just like daring each other. I bet you won't do this. I bet you won't do this. I think it was like on the count of three, we just gonna start doing some like, you feel me, just fucking and stuff. So it was like one, two, three, and then bro, after that, all you saw was shit flying. All you heard was boom, bro. You saw Pampers flying out the bag, and we was just doing stuff just to just do it. Pampers was flying. We was sticking gum to the bottom of the Pampers. He's putting baby oil on the aisle, just like squirting it everywhere, bro. It was really like fucking losing our man. I don't know what was wrong with us, bro. Niggas can't do nothing like that today. I'm too much to lose. Them was the days and not, that's not even everything that we did. Bro, that's not even half of what we was doing back then. What make it so crazy is that like, we would just walk out the store like we just like, and nothing happened. It wasn't like we would just go into the store and immediately, nah, we just walk around. We'd be in there for a minute. So instantly it wasn't like when we walk in, savage mode shit turn up, nah. We'd walk around. You feel me? Just be, we, we was bored. But yeah, so that was those two story times I went. But I feel like these were short, but I definitely got more story times for y'all. If y'all want some more story times, let me know. Um, y'all can hit me up on my social medias. They're gonna be in the description. Follow my Instagram, Twitter, all that, bro. Give me some ideas. Yeah, make sure y'all give this video a like, subscribe. And yeah, go subscribe to my second channel. It's gonna be in the description. I'm gonna start doing a lot of 
um, like challenges and stuff. Channel called Keontae and Selena be on the lookout for some lit videos. We're gonna be doing shout outs too. Like shout out to whoever, we're gonna shout y'all out. Whoever sent us this video, we're gonna shout y'all out in the video. I'm gonna see y'all in my next video, I'm out. Look, I know you, you just wanna fuck me for the fame. Wanna fuck me cause I'm diamonds on my chain, girl, don't you? Don't you, yeah, oh.